Welcome to White Box Learning Rockets 2.0. Rockets 2.0 teaches the principles of rocketry in an engaging and accessible manner. Purely cloud-based, your students will be engaged in the complete engineering design process. As always, students will log in here on the application login page with the same ID they would use for our other STEM applications. While most STEM learning systems transition students directly from the abstract to the hands-on, Whitebox Learning first ensures a proper connection between the STEM content and the student's applied knowledge. Then, once satisfied with their simulated results, students can print templates to scale that accurately match their virtual designs, ensuring a proper connection between the virtual and the hands-on. The white box learning engineering design process starts with research, which includes standards-based content, worksheets, tutorials, and quizzes. Here, I'm learning about stability. To ensure a proper understanding of this concept, it is reinforced with illustrations that I can manipulate in order to see for myself the impact of various trade-offs. These animations reinforce the concepts and, perhaps most importantly, do so within the context of the student's own design. Next, I can take my new knowledge to the engineering section and test my own theories by applying various trade-offs on my own solid model. These icons give me a menu of options to choose from, while these icons allow me to see in 3D and in real time the changes and the effects of my changes. As a reminder, all of this is going on from a browser. There are no CDs to download. Everything is fully integrated into one complete web-based applied STEM learning system. I only need my login ID in a browser. Along the way, I will save my designs in order to compete with other classmates throughout the district 24-7. The airshow simulation includes two rockets competing for total flight time and or maximum height. The scene itself, dynamic camera views, sound, and a leaderboard all add to the student engagement. To the students, this looks and feels like a game, but it is actually an extraordinarily powerful simulation and analysis tool. Once the competition is complete, students are presented with detailed results about both designs. There is a lot of information here, but nothing to tell them how to improve their designs. That is their job, the student's job, to interpret these results along with everything that's come before it and to develop and act upon their own theories. In this Rockets 2.0 engineering challenge, the path to the leaderboard is through effective critical thinking. And all the while, the teacher can measure and monitor the progress of each student, also in real time, as we are capturing each iteration and graphically displaying the links between the student's content knowledge and their application, that is, between their effort and performance. This method of building and testing virtual models before actually building physical models has strong roots in industry. But where the objective in industry is to maximize productivity, our objective here is to maximize learning. The fully integrated nature of this learning system, the ease with which students can engineer their models, and certainly the more exciting elements of a game-like simulation, all engage students to design and test numerous even hundreds of designs before actually building a physical model of their optimized design. While Rockets 2.0 can be used as a completely standalone virtual learning system, we believe there is great value in building and testing a real model. Accordingly, in order to connect the virtual to the physical, our outputs and build and test sections include a variety of reports, print templates, and instructions for building a physical model of their optimized design. We can also assist you in making provisions for the actual kits your students will use to build their physical models. 
please see our website for our kit offerings. So, how do the four forces of flight work with and against each other to produce flight? What design changes most affect weight, thrust, drag, stability, and recovery? What is the center of gravity? What is the center of pressure? And why does the relationship between the two matter? The White Box Integrated STEM Learning Framework empowers and engages students to ask and answer these and many other questions for themselves. This is higher order thinking, an essential key to an effective STEM learning process and beyond. This concludes our Rockets 2.0 demo. Thank you, and as always, if you have any questions or need any assistance, please don't hesitate to contact us.